Miley Cyrus says she wasn't living some fairy tale during a relationship with Liam Hemsworth. Miley Cyrus is opening up about her previous marriage to Liam Hemsworth and her journey to sobriety. In an interview with Rolling Stone published Friday, Cyrus shared that despite how she was portrayed, she was not happy and was going down a dark path in 2018 while she was engaged to Hemsworth. A couple of years ago, it looked like I was living some fairy tale. It really wasn't, the Plastic Hearts artist said. At that time, my experimentation with drugs and booze and the circle of people around me was not fulfilling or sustainable or ever going to get me to my fullest potential and purpose. Cyrus, 28, discussed how she felt the media fixated on her appearance as a point of reference for her sanity noting how when her hair was long and, blonde, it meant that she was sane right now but when she dyed her hair or was growing out her armpit hair it meant she was on drugs. She's got a man. She's living in a house playing wife, Cyrus said. Dude, I was way more off my path at that time than any of the times before where my sanity was being questioned. Cyrus and Hemsworth called it quits in August 2019, less than a year into their marriage and ten years after meeting on the movie set. The Black Mirror actress said that for now she's focused on being 100% sober because she hasn't learned how to not take it too far or be balanced. Cyrus has openly talked about her sobriety before and revealed that she fell off during the pandemic. The Wrecking Ball singer, who shared she was six months sober in June, told Zane Lowe in an interview for Apple Music released November 23 that she slipped up amid the pandemic. I fell off and I realized that I now am back on sobriety, two weeks sober, and I feel like I really accepted that time," said the musician. One of the things I've used is, don't get furious, get curious. So don't be mad at yourself, but ask yourself, what happened? Cyrus said she's not a moderation person and clarified that her issue is not with alcohol, but the resulting consequences of her actions under the influence. I don't have a problem with drinking, she continued. I have a problem with the decisions I make once I go past that level, I've just been wanting to wake up 100%, 100% of the time. 